Hey everybody, it's your girl Bev and I'm back with a plan of haul. So, I was on some sales on YouTube and I have a small order from Crafter's Companion and a gift from my big sister. So I'm just going to start with this napkin set. It's the big table napkins, the small napkins. And the placemat, these are going to be a journal. I'm going to make it a journal. This is a scented sachet. I'm going to use the bag, take the scented out. It smells wonderful, by the way. But I'm going to take that out. Then I have this two-year planner that my husband bought me from the Dollar Tree. It starts in January 2021. So, it's awesome. It has cats on every page. Look at that. So, I have that. Next, I have some different ribbons. I mean, <laughs> lace that I purchased so these are the colors I'm not going to open them but I'll bring it closer some navy blue and the white and the good thing about white ones, you can dye them any color that you like. So I have these mini CD envelopes. We use these in the junk journals. It's um, the multicolored pack. Then I'm making a Alice in Wonderland journal. So I have these Alice in Wonderland stamps and the Mad Hatter die that I could use my die cutting machine and cut some Mad Hatters out. Then I have this Adore mask and stencil set. You know, you put it on the page and you rub your ink on. Next is, oh, here's my other sachet. I have two of the sachets. Here's my Tim Holtz. I got the milk caps. I have this Artful Silhouette stamp. So, stamp on you can color it in if you want. Then I have the Remnant stamp. I love this stamp. I wanted it for the hot air balloon, but this has all of the New York train-like stops. This is 4th Avenue, Kings Highway. Coney Island, 57th Street, Manhattan, Metropolitan Plaza, Queens Plaza, and 34 68th Avenue. That's the address. And I'm from New York, so I was like, oh, I love that. Next, I have some Tim Holt Distress Oxide inks. I have tea dye. I actually have two tea dye. Cause it was so hard to find so in that sale I said let me get them while she's offering them sponge sugar and antique linen so now here's my haul from crafters companion these are the special noir metallic pencils it's a set of 12 pencils. These are the color palettes here. And they came with these free pads. I opened one so you can see. Uh, it's like uh, patterns on there that you color in with the metallic pencils. It shows up so super nice. So it's, a, it's two of these. They're different palettes and then it's these two 
and then there's six by six paper pad that also has the patterns on the paper and you use like a mandala you use it I hope it's showing up <laughs> you use it with the metallic pencils to create backgrounds for your cards or pieces in your junk journal so that's my small haul from Crafters Companion now my gift from my sister, which is also from Crafter's Companion, is, let me get it up, the Gemini Foil Press. Yes, I was so happy when she bought me this. It's broken up because she also bought me extra foils to go with it this color is turquoise this is called cerise it's like a hot pink this one is called holly which is a christmas green and this one is called berry which is a christmas red so when she shipped it to me she put them in the box so shipping wouldn't be so much so this is the user guide and the plates inside that you need to use the foil press. Okay, so it came with the mat. I don't want to take it out, but I'll take the foil out. This is a gold foil that they start you off with, a roll of gold foil. Then you have the finger protectors then you have the tweezers that you pick up the hot dyes with and this is the mat to put the hot dyes on and it also came with free dyes these is a two pack here and a three pack here of different dyes happy birthday here's a butterfly and here's a um I forgot what they call it, but you know, it's like a little design, but they have a name for it. Then there's a corner die there and the frame. I'm so happy about the frame. So this is the foil press. And how it works is you when you turn it on you push it to start you put your your uh, foil and your die down on here and it's for a certain amount of minutes then when it beeps you slide it off like that you don't lift it up you just slide it out because you don't want to damage the machinery inside so you just slide it back like that and you run it through your Gemini machine I know I showed my Gemini Jr. on a few lives. And you die cut and foil. You foil your die cut at the same time. Foil and die cut at the same time. So, so this is my small haul. If you enjoyed the haul, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below if you have any of these items or if you have any questions about these items. Again, my name is Beverly, and the channel is She Loves Planners and Crafting, and I'll be seeing you guys again soon. Bye.